Hello, my revivers. I'm here with you today with a video about what I've been feeling and, oh my gosh, I literally have been like beating myself up like, what did you do? What did you do? What did you do? So long story short, um, I am up and about because I had to do something for another situation that I'm a part of and you guys will see that and I will let you guys know all about that um it's gonna happen Monday so um I'm excited to be a part of this God just truly does answer prayers with the right people at the right time to come into your life I just thank God for that and um I met up with this guy I call him C-Dove his name is Chris he's amazing 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 and um, you would see in my channel during my journey, every time I post a video at 6 o'clock in the morning, he was there, 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 rooting me on, cheering me on and everything. And that is amazing, amazing, amazing. He's a cool dude. He has an awesome channel. He did crazy, but he did OMAD and lost lots of weight lots of weight. I'm trying not to tell too much, but he lost lots of weight. But anyway, um, do what you can to, if you can go in the comments and during the times I was going to the gym, basically every day he's always commenting. Um, I don't think it's really been too many days that he missed commenting on my journey. So, um, yeah, I came to you guys to talk to you because, um, yeah, y'all see I broke my fast. Y'all see I broke it with the broth, which was pretty okay. It was decent. Um, but, uh, yeah. From this point forward, the reason for the question and answer and the reason why I'm not going to answer too many questions in the comments until that time, as a YouTuber, it's only one of me. And y'all know I love, love, love to, to respond and communicate with my um, revivors. I'm not the type of person where you leave me a comment and I'm not commenting back. Who am I to do that when you took the time? And you will always hear me say this. You took the time out of your day to comment to me. It, it irks my royal nerve and I unsubscribe from people when I passionately follow you and have a question in regards to something you may have shared in your video and you blatantly ignore me. Now, if I've ever done that to anybody, like blatantly ignore you, we don't talk, you don't know me, I haven't, you know, know you outside of YouTube and you sent me a response and asked a genuine question and I, re I, re I re disregarded you. Please let me know because I try my best not to do that. But remember, it is one of me. So every now and then it may happen. You know what I mean? And you know, this is technology. So sometimes things like that may happen, you know. Um, with that being said, uh, this journey to me has been so eye-opening. I thank you guys for all the support. This is not done. There's a next level to this because I have to get to a certain point in my journey to feel good about it to the point where I don't need to hold myself accountable any longer by doing what I'm doing on a daily basis. But um, until that time comes, I'm going to continue vlogging and sharing my journey. Do y'all know this is my life, my journey, and I have to do it my way? Not only do I have to do it my way, but I know my body. And you don't know everything I've been through in life. You don't know everything I experienced with my health issues, with my 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 weight, with my eating, with with everything. So it's a lot more than just watching a video video and telling someone, hey, you need to do this, and you should listen to this, and you should listen to that. I've been raw vegan before. I've been vegan. I've been raw. I've been um. Uh, what do you call it? Vegetarian. I tried pescatarian. I've done and tried so many things. I am not young. If you if you don't know it, I'm about to be 40 years old. I'm not 26, 27, 28 on here. You know, trying to do this thing and 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 don't have a lot of life experience behind me. And it's a lot that may still be young, which I feel still feel like I'm young still. But the problem is. I'm, I can't sit down and do a video every day saying, oh, I've done this, I've done that, I've done this, I've done that, just to explain myself to everybody. I can't do that. You know what I mean? So if you're genuinely following me, you would know that, you would understand that, and we always have the one-on-one -on -one talk, so you really got to know me and understand why I do the things I do, but I like to be a woman of my word. I want to get my weight off, and not only do I want to get it off, but I want to share that with you, you know? Um, so I just feel like... Um, this is just the beginning because I'm 50 pounds. I, I'm not going to act like that is not nothing. That is awesome. But at the end of the day, um, I still have a long way to go. I still have a long way to go. And in my brain, I, I'm thinking 215, 200, but I still feel like 
I, I, mm, we shall see. I'm going to let you guys know. So, um, that's one thing um, I, I wanted to tell y'all. The reason, like I said, for the question and answer, so that way I'm not repetitively saying the same thing over and over. So, if you genuinely are watching and care to know about how this journey was for me in the inside, meaning my mental and things that I couldn't share 24 hours of my day, I can't. Like, the videos would be ridiculous to try to upload. I won't have space for them. I mean, come on, who, got to, who has to keep going through all that? Y'all know what I mean. So... I can share as much as I can, but I feel like I see so many weight loss journeys the way I do it, not trying to shut nobody down, but the way I do it is account holding me accountable because how can I, I can't make up nothing. I can't you know, tell you I did this and I did that and it not match with my day-to-day -day videos. If we talk about something in the comments in one video, and then the next day I load another video and I'm talking in my daily life as my vlog about what we talked about, you know it's real. You get what I'm saying? Um, I didn't want to be the one to sit in front of you and be like, how to lose 30 pounds in such and such a days, and just tell you in one sitting like I'm sitting right now, on day one, on day two, on day, and just going through the days with you. No, that's not what I want. That's If I was on the other side looking at someone's journey and for it to be some something to inspire me, seeing your ups and downs. Why hide the ups and downs? Why hide the things that um, really allow people not to feel like they can't do it? It feel like they can't do it because like, oh my gosh, all she did was eat great and exercise amazing and just lost his weight. No, boo. No bay. <laughs> no, it don't work like that. There's frustration. You will fall off. You will eat what you're not supposed to eat. Things happen. Things happen. I can say my hand, my hand to everything I love on my right hand, to everything I love that I on that water fast did amazing. Food, I did not put any food in my mouth on those 12 days that I decided to go and I only wanted to go three. My initial day was three and I started water fasting May 16th and I decided three was not enough and I continued on and I continued on. After that third day, I went four, five, six, seven, eight. And so now that I'm looking back at it, but I was so emotional, so upset with myself that I couldn't finish. But now that I'm looking back at it, girl, you did that. You did that. You know how many people reached out to me like, girl, <laughs> I can't do 72 hours. I can't do 48 hours or you know what I mean? Let me know that what I did wasn't for nothing, but I'm going to go even more in detail on that on Sunday. But guys, I have a treat for you. I have a treat for you. If you stayed this long, I have a treat for you. I love you guys. I hope this right here that I'm getting ready to share with you inspires you because this is the thing that kept me going every day when I felt like, oh my gosh, another freaking day. I can't do it. This is what kept me going. So I hope you guys enjoy it. I love you guys. See you later, Gators. So I bought this from Old Navy. It is a medium, if y'all can see that. It is a medium. Okay? Yeah, medium for who? Not my chunky self. But I can fake it at the gym, right? Yeah. And this is all I get. This is it. This is it. Nothing more. Nothing less. I can't, if I do this and then look, it jacks way up <laughs> and it's not supposed to be there. So I can't fit this. This is something, this is going to be a non-scale victory for me to see how this fits on me as time goes on. So, all right, y'all. Now I'm just seeing the before. That was taken a day before I even started the gym or anything at my highest weight. I tried on this jacket that I could not wait to get in because y'all know my favorite color is lime green. And I bought this from Old Navy a while ago and I have not been able to wear it, okay? So, I want to show y'all how this jacket fits after me losing 47 pounds. We're getting ready to show y'all that. Because I still get a little frustrated because I still see these. I want these to go and they are going, but not fast enough. So, this is the type of stuff that motivates me versus the scale. So this is me putting a jacket on, and this is, what is today? 26. The 26th. May 26, 2019. Do y'all see that? Do y'all see that? Do y'all see? I, I literally, ooh, ooh, I literally have space to pull the jacket down. My drawers are so loose, but I literally got space to pull the jacket down. Y'all remember the other one? It was up here when I tried to close it. This is the jacket. 
this is a non-scale victory for me. This is what makes me push because your girl coerced is to the gym if I wanted to. Let's push y'all. Non-scale victories make me push harder. All right, y'all. Later, haters. Stop it. Press pause and do that. Press it, baby.